Hello everybody, my name is Chris Brown, field agronomist with Burris Seed. I just wanted to go through some of the basics on uh, doing some pre-harvest scouting and prioritization for harvest. Uh, doing some push tests here, and then I'm going to just demonstrate uh, some pinch tests also. Again, with the season we've had, it's important to make sure that you're ready for harvest. I'm out here to demonstrate the push test to check our stock integrity here. When you're doing that, you're going to want to get your right at waist high, push out on the corn stalk so it's at a 30 degree angle, and check that it springs back. You continue doing that down the line for about 100 stalks, and you want it to spring back. When it doesn't spring back, that's when you're going to count it, like that one right there. That one doesn't spring back. Uh, we're going to keep doing that down the line. When you hit 100 plants, keep track of how many fell pushed over. And if that number's below 10 to 15%, you're doing pretty good. Above 10 to 15%, you have an increased risk for stock lodging. And that's a field I would prioritize for harvest. As an alternative to the push test that I showed earlier, you can do your stock pinch test. You're gonna wanna come down below the slowest node and pinch right there. And if that is gonna crush underneath your fingers with a little pinch like that one does there, you're going to want to, again, do that for about 100 stocks. If you get above 10 to 15%, uh, that's when you're going to want to prioritize this field for harvest. With the season we've had, this corn is drying down pretty rapidly. Getting out, out here and making sure that corn's going to stand for when you come to get it is going to be key to having a successful harvest this season.